Today we have been working all year on this project. We have researched, we have studied, we have done so many things to get ready for this project. And like Mr. Sorensen said, your students wrote the entire thing. They wrote the lyrics, they wrote the music. They decided on all the staging. They did the choreography. They came up with their costumes and their props. They've done everything by themselves. So you should be very, very proud of your students and make sure you give them some ice cream when you get home. Right? Yeah. <laughs> so you should be very, very proud of them. So like we said, we have four operas to present to you today. We're gonna to just go class by class. After every single class, It'll take us about two or three minutes to switch out and get everything ready for the next part. In our third opera, please be aware that candy will be thrown into the audience. Now this is very exciting and parents, I would like you to control yourself just as much as our students will. <laughs> that if the candy comes to you, you can pick it up. But please do not scramble and fight the other parents for that candy. You don't need to do that. Uh, if you really need some, I will give you some after, so don't worry, okay? But just be aware that that is coming, so watch out. And they're gonna do it very nicely, so hopefully no one gets knocked down. <laughs> all right? Um, so all of these plays are based on Shakespeare plays. We studied three plays in our class. We studied, um, now I have to remember everything. We studied Romeo and Juliet, we studied Macbeth, and then we studied Midsummer Night's Dream. The students then chose their favorite, and they wrote their own play based off of Shakespeare's plays. So the first two that you will see are based off of Romeo and Juliet, the third one is based off of Macbeth, and the last one is based off of Midsummer Night's Dream. So I really am so happy that you're here. I'm so excited to share this with you, and I hope you enjoy four operas.
Thank you for all your hard work and investment, and thank you for coming to support us. And we are just so happy that it turned out so well. So amazing job, everybody. Round of applause.
All right, another excellent ensemble award goes to, let me see if I can find the students that I um, Thank you. 
Thank you so much. As we close up, very quickly, we'll give you a moment to come up and have your Kodak moment with your students and, and, and uh, mingle with them for a few minutes and we'll take them back to class. Um, if any of you are willing to stay for a few minutes and crash chairs, that would be super helpful. It's just a lot of strange work, so you can take down by yourself. So we certainly appreciate that help. One last thing before I let you go. Um, we have the Utah Opera also. This noise comes to us from the Beverly Taylor Arts. Beverly Taylor Sorensen Arts Program is a mouthful. Um, we appreciate the support of that institution and are proud to partner with them in the Grand School District. Um, please talk with your legislators and help us to continue to fund these programs that are meaningful and, and we need their support. Thank you again so much for coming. Have a fantastic day and from St. Louis.